Hi guys, welcome to Empower Your Body. I'm Alicia Kliegel. This week, it's all about spring. And with the arrival of spring, come some of the tastiest, sweetest fruits and vegetables you'll find. This week, we're showcasing five. Also, I'm going to offer you an effective fat burning workout. And then we're going over your five steps to empowerment to help you clear your mind, refocus your attention, and achieve your goals. Stay with us. Hi guys, so with the arrival of spring comes more light and lots of fresh fruits and vegetables. So where better to get those fruits and vegetables is your local market. Today I am at one of my local markets, Al Medina Market in northern New Jersey. So what do I come here for? This time of year, pretty much I start with artichokes. And although they are harvested in the fall, their main crop is actually in the spring. And they're high in vitamin K, iron, and niacin. Yum. Loaded. Strawberries. Guys, I could smell them from here. Strawberries, they peak between April and June. And they're high in vitamin C and potassium. Yum. I use these in smoothies or just eat them. This weekend, I swear, I ate like three containers full. So now we are up to grapefruits. Grapefruits are high in vitamin C as well as vitamin A, and they peak from January through kind of like uh, the middle of summer, but spring, yum, sweet and tasty. Let's move on, right? Now we have some asparagus. Their main crop is from approximately March to June, and they are very high in protein, folate, and vitamin A. Protein, can you believe it? That was quite surprising to me. Another one, I'm still thinking about the strawberries, sorry guys. Okay, last is we have radishes. Radishes are high in riboflavin, B6, and vitamin C, and they are at their sweet, crunchiest best this time of spring. So, I know I just told you guys a whole bunch of different information. Go to empoweryourbody.com for more information or like us on Facebook. My question to you, healthy green, name a healthy green. What is one of the healthiest greens and why. So I'm going to go shopping, gather up some stuff, probably get back to those strawberries, and I'll see you in the studio for our workout. Bye, guys. Hi, I'm Alicia Kliegel, exercise physiologist and creator of Empower Your Body TV. If you want to lose weight, tone up, or improve your wellness, get excited. You're about to change your life. Go to EmpowerYourBody.com to view hundreds of free fitness videos, get our local schedule, and download Empower Your Body workouts. Like us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and get daily fit tips. Call the number you see below and begin empowering your body. Hey guys, welcome back. Here's your power three, three fat burning exercises that will allow you to stay sexy and trim, ready for spring. We just came back from the store, got our strawberries, and our post-workout meal is waiting for us when we're finished. Let's get to it. We're doing three things. Please, 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 please get checked by a physician, get clearance to exercise before you begin any of these exercises. The first one that we're going to do will be a squat with a shoulder press. So. What I want you to do is find a weight that you feel comfortable and safe, but challenged, lifting overhead. Your stance, a bit wider than hips, feet turned out, knees follow toes. Core and abdomen tight, palms facing your ears. When you come down, I'd love for your elbows to touch your, your knees. My back is straight, my glutes have sunk, meaning my chest is not parallel to the floor. My chest is forward. I come up evenly and press back down. Again, down. Don't hang out down here. <laughs> That's not what I want. Exhale. This is the pace. One more I'll show you. 
Okay, and I'll go through that again. So again, elbows on your knees, chest is forward. As you lift up evenly, press, 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 exhale. That's a squat with a shoulder press. Want you guys to start those off. Of course, you've warmed up, right? Got to warm up. Five, six, seven, ten minutes on the machine. Increase your body heat. Then you'll do those exercises ten times. Next thing, we'll do a balance row. I'd like you balanced on your right leg. Left leg is extended straight out behind you. I keep my left hand behind me because that keeps my shoulders back. And then you exhale and row. Again, 10 on the right arm. Next exercise, we're gonna jump rope. I want you to jump rope for 30 seconds. How do, you, how, how do you know when the jump rope is your proper length, proper height for you? You stand on it and it should come right under your arm. If it's too short or too long, make some knots in it or get a new jump rope. 30 seconds, jumping rope. Okay guys, so you know what jumping rope looks like, right? Here we go. Nice and controlled and even, I'm not slamming on the floor. Some people have to do a little extra jump, that's fine. But I want 30 seconds. After the 30 seconds, you go back to the squat and the press, and then the other leg balance with the row. I'd like you guys to do that twice. What I mean is, boom, squat, press. Balance, row, jump rope, 30 seconds. Other side, squat, press, row. Those two, both 10 times, jumping rope. And then do that whole thing again. So you're pretty much jumping rope four times. Stick with that approximately four times a week, including in your cardio and your regular routine, that will help you burn some fat. So before you know it, you'll be ready for spring. I'm going to hit my smoothie because it's yummy and tasty. Those strawberries were fabulous. my smoothie and depending on what you put in it, it helps to replenish your body after a great workout. Now is my Aspire Hire segment of the show. This is where I offer you insights and suggestions on how to improve your life while avoiding obstacles that could get in the way when you're trying to achieve your health and fitness goals. Since we are focusing all on a new beginning, I am deciding to offer you my five steps to empowerment. What are they? Here we go. Number one. Decide what it is that you want. If you do not decide specifically what it is that you will want, you have no destination. You must decide what it is that you want. Number two, ask yourself, do you deserve it? You, this might sound odd, but I think you might be surprised sometimes to find out what the real answer is. Ask yourself, do you deserve it? If you don't think you deserve it, you will never have it. You will never own it. Number three, Become educated. You've got to become educated. You need to know how to get to the end goal. If you want to improve your fitness, you need to hire a fitness professional. You want to build a wall, you have to talk to a contractor. Become educated. Number four, do not judge yourself. Guys, you will come across obstacles. You will have bad days, slow days. Don't judge yourself, keep moving forward. And lastly, enjoy the process. 
enjoy the process along the way. You have so much to learn along the way. It's not just about the destination, it's the journey too. So those are my five steps of empowerment that can help you achieve any goal that you'd like to achieve. I am now going to answer your question. Healthy green, what is a healthy green? Kale is an extremely healthy green. It has vitamin A, it has vitamin C, it has vitamin K. It also has been known to help decrease your chance of getting cancer. Still not sure if it's been proven, but I'll take the chance. So I am now going to think about what I'm gonna use for kale for dinner. I'm gonna go back to my smoothie and we'll see you soon. Cheers. So that's it for this week's Empower Your Body. Thank you for watching our Spring Into Fitness episode. For more information, go to empoweryourbody.com or like us on Facebook at slash EYBTV. Until next time, please don't forget to be well, eat well, drink plenty of water, and don't ever forget to empower your body. I'm going for a run. See you soon.